getting very promptly rejected. I was discovered literally by Vishal and Shekhar when I was performing a solo concert in a dark dingy bar called Zenzi in Bandra in Bombay. And out of the crowd were these amazing human beings and musicians, Vishal and Shekhar, who thought it was worth putting their money behind us and release our album. And that's how our first album came out in 2006. And what the record labels thought will never sell went on to become the highest selling non-film music album, selling over 75,000. And we sold hand to hand, literally, in our concerts. And we would like to thank all the college festivals in this India to keep Indian independent music scene alive. It is because of your festivals at co colleges like yours that we come and perform. Otherwise, television or radio doesn't play our kind of music at all. At least till last four or five months, it was not. And nowadays, channels are picking up and playing independent music, finally. Anyway. The story is this, that finally in 2008, we thought we, we deserve to be heard around the world. And we started putting our own money in and traveling abroad and trying to knock on doors in the world music scene in UK. And in 2010, after much struggle, we got this call from BBC London to come and perform one song on an amazing TV show called Later with Jules Holland. It is an amazing TV show where amazing artists come and perform and get noticed and luckily for my tv episode there was robert bland the legend from led zeppelin and Mary Seppel, again a legend in gospel singing and then you had darling adele on the other side and arcade fire which is a very very popular alternative rock band from europe so because of them, we got noticed, and we played this one song, which made our album to become number one on UK world music charts within a week. And since then, we've 11 times we've climbed up to become number one in the last two years. This is the song we played on that TV show, and this one is called No Man Will Ever Love You Like I Do. Before I start this song, this song is specially dedicated to the very, very minuscule population of beautiful girls of IIT Kanpur. <laughs> Trust me, you have, you have, you are in the best situation where you have so many options to pick from. <laughs> but I pity you guys, man. I really pity you. <laughs>
Bring up djembe. No, that book. Uh, All right, the next song is a, another brand new song, and it's called Jag Changa, which means the world is beautiful. Despite all the negative things that we face in life, life still can be really, really wonderful, and the, so can be the world. I hope you like this one. This is again written by a dear friend, Neeraj Singh, and it is something that is, the music of this particular song is greatly influenced by our travels to UK. I hope you like this one. back in a minute. Thank you.
That was the fastest string change in Kanpur history. Go on, say something else after that. All right, we'll go to the next song. Last year, or maybe a year, year and a half uh, back, I got my debut opportunity to get into Bollywood. And through this song, it's a kawali called Har Saans Mein Har Dhadkan Mein Hotu. So I want you all to sing this song along with me. Let's go. Har Saans Mein Har Dhadkan Mein Hotu. Come on, everyone. Har Saans Mein. So whenever that line comes, join in. Here we go. Come on, Kanpur, this is a Kavali. You know how to do this.
एक ही तमन्ना है कुछ को ही पाए हम जैसे अंधेरा में और हाँ सवेरा तुम ओ एक ही तमन्ना है कुछ को ही पाए हम जैसे अंधेरा में और हाँ सवेरा तुम मरमा मेरे फिर भी लग गए हर महक में भी हो तुम हाँ तेरी कसम हर सांस में हर धड़क में हो तुम कमाल एवरी वन सिंगल आ हर सांस में हर धड़क में हो या खुदा कसम हर सांस में हर धड़क में हो या लाल लाल सांस में हर धड़क में हो हर सांस में हर धड़क हर सांस में हर धड़कन में हो तुम या खुदा कसम हर या लाल लाल सांस में सच तेरी कसम हर सांस में हाँ मेरी कसम हर सांस में song tonight and this is a this is a song about a very very beautiful girl from my hometown Mysore this is probably the first ever Hindi song I wrote and I exhausted all my Hindi vocabulary with it uh, but nevertheless 15 15 years since I wrote this song it still is the most special song of the band and probably also the most popular song uh, so much so that we got invited to play this song for the Queen of England when she celebrated her 60th anniversary as the Queen of England at Windsor Castle. <laughs> and we have a very, very special dance choreography done for this particular song. Mr. Gaurav Vaz is your dance instructor tonight. He's going to show you, uh, show you the coolest dance move of the century. I want you all to watch him learn and immediately reproduce right here right now are you gay my jikanpur hey stand up daddy what is sitting down please get up enough camera and all you do it you won't listen to me i won't play the song that's all Ready? 
ready now? This one is called Mysore Se Aai. I think this side of the crowd should finally get up. Now enough. I'm bored looking at you guys sitting down like as if you're listening to some classical kacheri going on here. Come on. This one is called Mysore Se Aai. Watch him, okay? And if you can't see him, he's your dance instructor this side. And if he can dance, anyone can. So let's do this. Come on, one last time. Put your hands up, Kanpur! All right.
thank you very much. One more time, go to Oz on the bass guitar. Willie on the drums and percussions. Bob Chandramani on the flute. And Brad and Stephen Louis on the guitars, ukulele and banjo. Please do get in touch with us on Facebook, The Raghu Dixit Project. And if you have liked our band, here's an opportunity to show how much you like us by going to the UK Asian Music Awards website, which is there, on, the link is on our Facebook page. Please go and vote for us. We've been nominated as the best alternative act this year in the UK. Try and spend one minute to vote for us. Thank you very much, that'll be great. And you could also catch us on Twitter as TRDP, the Raghu Dixit Project, or individually our names, Raghu Dixit, Gauravas. How are, what are you, what's, Willy. And then Parth is not there. Parth is not there, <laughs> even if he's there. And Brad and Stephen, of course, he's there. Thank you very much and good night. I hope to come back again soon. All the best to every one of you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks to the core community of Antaragni Festival. Thank you so much for inviting me here, choosing about all other artists, and getting us down all the way to IIT Kanpur. I will really, really remember this for a long time. And if you want to meet us and give us a hug, I will be right there. Thank you. OK, also, also one more thing. Day after tomorrow, we play at the NH7 Weekender in Delhi. So if any of you want to make the trip to Delhi or have friends in Delhi, Tell them, and I just got a call from the guys at NH7 saying, if you write to discounts at nh7.in and put Raghu Dikshit in the title of your email, you get a 10% off on tickets for the entire weekend. So there's Megadeth playing. Better than that, there's Raghu Dikshit playing. So you need to make it there. <laughs>